morning YouTube and start things off before I start the intro with a time lapse down to either Uxbridge or Hillingdon station and so I've got to take my sister down there so yeah did I say time lapse well if I didn't it's going to be a time lapse In case you couldn't tell by that last clip, my sister changed her mind. Georgia, Georgia's my sister. I don't know why I keep saying my sister. I think most of you subscribed to this will know by now. But, um, yeah, she wanted to come to Denham in the end. So, yeah, I suppose it beats going all the way to Uxbridge. Don't know where mum heard Uxbridge from. Anyway, Back to the time lapse, I might take the base water woods now. You'll see where it is in a sec. Just turned it on to normal recording because this is a new 30 mile an hour limit. I want to see what these cars behind do. It might not do anything, but I'm a I'm abiding by the speed limit at the moment. Thirty, so it's, they look like it is thirty. Well, it does actually, but it used to be forty all the way up that bit. So it's just gone to forty now. But I want to see if the cars behind show some impatience on the hill. only two of them so what normally happens is when you actually get to 40 down here they start planning their overtake on the hill and they actually go for the overtake I have had people overtake me here on this bend which is lethal they don't know what's coming, especially coming over a brow of a hill. They don't look like they're going to do anything. I think the first car seen me start a recording because he's holding quite far back now. I think he knows I know what he's going to do. Bayswater. Brakes big crematorium is just to our left actually. Well actually it's a little bit further up and to our left but it's there. If that makes any sense. Lordy Hillingdon Council. These are tyre killers. I'll probably car in a hedge there to avoid that one. Oh, that's bad. I hope you get the gist of what I'm trying to say to you because some people don't wait especially some BMW drivers now I'm not saying all of you are like that but a bit it's a good 80% maybe 75% the won't indicate will just pull out whenever it's, there's a rule going around going up give way to me I've got a nicer car that's not true you give way to whoever has priority. But yeah. A little life lesson. Don't be an idiot.
in the car. Because if someone in particular catches you be an idiot, you're going to be stopped. And they're going to have a few choice words for you. So, yeah. I'm going to jump off, actually. It's just a really bumpy ride. In a sec. Who do you think we are? New Forest. I love her. Ollie knows where we are, though. Just got done with our walk. I didn't film anything because I'd probably make them feel uncomfortable. But, yeah, time-lapse time. That Range Rover you saw then, towards the end of the time lapse, I actually stopped him from overtaking before a roundabout. And he's getting pissy. And I went, no, no, to him coming as he came past. I said to tell him off for that. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna wait until a good few cars have gone past. I've got his plate and I'm gonna be reporting that because that is actually an offense on the run up to a roundabout. But you can actually be charged for that. I'll explain it more when I get home. In fact, actually, I'm gonna take the other way home, actually, in case he sees me. In case he does like a U-turn or something and he actually ends up seeing me. I hate drivers that do that and I will stop other drivers from doing it. If you do stop them and then they get aggressive and stop you, call 999. Because if you stop them from overtaking before a roundabout, that is perfectly legal, that is perfectly safe. You're preventing an accident. And make sure when you're coming over a roundabout, you make eye contact with other drivers. steering there. Because that lorry was coming up to that junction quite quick, I made the sudden decision to come out so I didn't risk a collision with him. Lorry drivers, please go slower than that at a junction. Coming up to it, sorry. This is 
what everyone calls, calls racer's corner. People come racing around here. It's 30 the whole way down. Perfectly fine being at 40 past the road, past the uh, HS2 works. So I think after the HS2 works, it can resume to 40, which was the speed of this road. But because of the um, HS2 and they're planning to build houses in the area. I reckon them keeping it at 30, so that becomes the norm, if that makes sense. Right, the next point I stop, I'm gonna um, switch back to hyperlapse. So that was two bibs from that car in, on the side of me then. So it's alerting me of a hazard. Just gonna slow down a little bit because it looks like it's up here. See so that he's turning the Lexus behind me to get off my backside. Not that I tell you. That Lexus driver is on his phone. If I stop he's not gonna know. I'm gonna switch to time lapse now. And that, guys, is the journey home. Belle knows where we are, that's why. Love her. I'm trying to take the keys out of the car. They ain't even in the bloody car. And again, guys, yeah, I'm inside the house now. But again, that first guy when I had to pull into the library where you saw me do the U-turn. Yeah. Oh, give way to me. I've got the bigger car. I should be allowed to overtake here and there. If you if you happen to be that BMW driver or Range Rover driver or whatever I said it was, you don't own the road, dickhead. All right, slow down. I stopped you from overtaking because there was a roundabout coming up, and you were still persisting to overtake. I was doing it to protect you. Okay, not everyone is trying to hinder your journey. They might see you doing something that could result in a serious collision. They might be protecting you. Okay? I've seen only Range Rovers do Range Rover Range Rovers? Range Rovers doing that. And it's starting to piss me off now. Just because you've got the better car, you think you're entitled to drive like a knob. Stop it. Before you get yourselves killed on the road. Alright? With that being said, and YouTube, don't you remove this video because that shows you support. But that being said, got YouTube on. I'm watching. Oh, it's one of old um, one of Noel Phillips' old videos. This must have been when he was um, six years ago. He must have been in flight video or something when he filmed this. But yeah, I think he lives in America now. I think Noel, if you somehow stumble across that, don't hate me if I got that wrong. But anyway, got one of Noel Phillips' old videos on. Bell's passed out here. Ollie's over here somewhere. Let's see if you can see him. Ollie, where are you? Oh, there you are. It's all right, mate. I just wondered where you were. But yeah, I'm going to try to make this vlog as long as possible. Sorry if it doesn't turn out the way I plan it to. You know what I mean? What's going on, Mr. Sun? It's back again. There we go.
Anyone else get that when you look at the sun? Right, well, not at the sun, but towards the sun, if you know what I mean. Oh, well. Oi. Talking to you. Oh, gorgeous. Ollie. Don't you pant your socks off, mate. Cotton socks, even. Might take these socks off and go put my foot in the pool. Where's the end of that hose? Might need to empty that. Yeah. Good job the brushes, eh? Yeah, I've lengthened it, so if you turn that, you know they say righty tighty, lefty loosey. If you turn that left, you can extend it a bit more, so yeah. And I'll take my socks off and get that emptied. I'll take my socks off because it saves something to put my Crocs on. I'm my window shut, I can't just put them through the window. Bless them. See, hang on, I'm gonna come back a sec, hang on. CBA to turn on photo mode, skip ahead about 30 seconds if you want, if that. I use the feature then where you can um, take a photo while recording. But yeah, they go really dark, these sunglasses, uh, these glasses even. Yeah, biofill they are. So it turns out they react to the UV rays. That's what that is. So yeah, I learned something new today. Socks are off, but I got these pair of socks right. Hang on. So I got a pair of socks that say Monday on them, and I got ones with days of the week on them, just for kicks. So if I forget what day of the week it is, I just look down at my foot like that. I can't find Tuesday's pair. I can't find Wednesday's pair either, excuse the mess. But putting the speaker there, opening the window, and let's get some tunes out while I fill up the pool. Someone tag, someone tag Life of Tom. I got the idea from him for that. Granted, I couldn't get a pool the same size as him, but, well, because if you've seen our garden, it would flood the garden, but yeah, better than nothing now, isn't it? Rip. That's flooded. Rest in peace, plant. Bit of watering helps get the... I don't know, what would you call that green stuff? Whatever it is, it helps get it out. Look, you do this one-handed, look. There's just a bit of water lifts it out, then what I'm going to do, because that's flooded, I'm just going to pick it up from this side and get it to go over that way and I'm going to spray it with a hose to get it out into the soil. Soil that eats up this the green stuff. Well, this soil does anyway. Not saying there's different kinds of soil, but I just found that the bush soil, the soil that's under the bush, tends to put it to good use by the looks of it. I mean, half the hedge is cut off, so that's probably half the reason why it's probably using the algae to its advantage. I think that's what it is. It's algae converts any bad toxins in the water to oxygen. And then that's how we got air, I think. Gonna stick this on the end of that so I can get more stuff off. So I'm gonna put the phone in there so I don't get soaked. I'm gonna put some music on. Admittedly, I was gonna put the phone up here, but I can't see the phone screen properly, so I don't know how well that's holding. I'm gonna to have to look back at the footage, hang on. It looks all right, providing the fact there's no wind or anything. So yeah, time lapse. Trying a different tactic. I turn the hose off. Because I know I'm just gonna get ridiculously wet. I could have just put the phone up here. I'm gonna do a time lapse because I've got copyright music playing. Right, that's off, but the spray is in the off position. The handle is the, in the block position. So, 
quick as I can, quick as I can. Oh, nice. I just noticed there's a dog turd there. I'll have to pick that up in a second. Good job I haven't stepped in it yet. Because what this does... I don't want that to burst off the end there. Look. I can clear the stuff off more faster. I can get off more faster. Just quickly, copyright music. So I just noticed it's got this thing on it. I'm an idiot. So much easier. You love her. She loves a little scratch right on the front of the chin there. Paul's nearly done. I gave up with that bloody thing on the end. Don't know why. Just as bloody fast without it. I didn't know why I tr tried it. Yes, I just had a hiccup. I don't know why. Mum, I'm calling you out. You brought this to stop the flies getting in. It ain't going to stop the flies when it keeps doing this. Then you've got to get hold of it like this. I swear, just some type of I could just go and just rip it off. You know what I mean? It's just so annoying. And on another note, I'm sorry, my brain just glitched then. I was like, shit, what was I about to say? But no, on another note, why did I turn the light on? <laughs> that wasn't the note. Um, I'm thinking, thinking, to be careful, of maybe... Opening the PO box, yes, that's a bit dirty. I might just actually wipe that off a bit. But yeah, the question is though, how much a PO box? I might ask life for Tom because I know he's got a PO box. PO box means post office, chill. I know some people what they're going to be commenting, but yeah, I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. Okay, granted, there's 111 of you, but there's about 5,000 of you over on TikTok. So, I don't know. I mean, this is going to go up after the TikTok video anyway, so I might as well just ask. But if you guys are seeing this now, let me know what you think. Oh, and by the way, to that guy who asked, how do you fill up a glass with one hand? For like, if you've got a dog in your hand or anything, I'll show you. Get in line with the tap. Boom. This tap's a bit fast. Boom. Sorted. Let's try not to spill it. I'll try to record me spilling it. I don't know why. Probably just some stupid gag thing. Bell? Don't do that. She gave me a heart attack sliding under the table. Blonk that there for a second. Bell Bell. Hello, oh, darling. Just checking my baby girl's all right. Oh, bloody hell. Even kneeling down on the floor now, it's hard to get up from. I'm just old. I might be 25, nearly 26, but I feel old. I'm a month away from being 26. Oh, I'm not happy about that. Well, under a month by the time you're seeing this. The vlog before this one. No, maybe the day before. That's it. Hang on, let me just check the date on my phone. Hang on. So, before Monday's vlog, so Sunday, would have been, yeah, I'm watching Sam and Monica, by the way. But, um, yeah. Sunday, from Sunday, it would have been a month. Do I have to be 26? I know I said the same thing last year, but do I have to be 26? Really? God, is there a way to just halt my age at 25 just for a bit? Just so I can enjoy it just a little bit longer? Like, I don't think I've been enjoying the age of 25. Ollie? Oh, good boy. You're going over there, good boy. The only reason why I tell him off for that is because here he will burn. You're not panting, are you, mate? Go on. You can go out there then if you want. He does understand English. He's very good at it. 
we got a dog whisperer and um, we asked um, Ollie through the dog whisperer how much English he understands. And um, so we said some key words to him, like go on and come here. And he understands quite a lot from what he's told the dog whisperer. So yeah, smart dog. I just got to find out what Rosie's problem is with me. Don't know why she's just not keen on me. Apparently, I don't know why. I must have done something at some point she didn't like. I don't know. Have you ever noticed, by the way, that the recording on here actually is high def? On that Samsung that's charging up on the arm there, that flip phone. Not even close. This is like 4K recording. Well, it's 4K recording on my phone. The reason why, I don't know what the hell is going on there with the lighting. Hang on. Right, I've asked it to focus on me. Hang on. It's a bit weird. But anyway. The reason why 4K videos have stopped, and I'll explain what I mean. Because if I scroll down. Wait, what? New Life of Tom... I watched that YouTube, God. Um, right. So there's that one up tonight, which you're probably too late for, for this now. So, But if you look under, oh wait, no, I won't tell you yet. But if you're watching on your TV, it should say next to the fuse, 4K. So if I find, oh, look, there's one, 4K. It's because I uploaded it from that phone, from the photos, rather than from the app. I uploaded from but which is what I've done for that vlog and that vlog and also this one but it won't show up as 4k but I'll only do it from the Samsung so so you guys I was trying to turn on the mic so you guys are having to tilt your head now sorry but just tilt your head for a second. See this app here, this Premiere Rush. Such a good app. But, say I want to export that. I've deleted the footage, so it'll just show whatever's there. I have to be paying that to do 4K videos. So what I might do is put that bit of um, cost of living to good use. Bear with me a second. Wait, what am I doing? Hang on. I'll be back in a sec. Sorry about making your head tilt like that. I'll try to edit it so most of the, ma the majority of this video is like this. But anyway, the reason why... No, 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 sorry. So with the cost of living, I might just use like 33 pound of that, or however much it was, just so I could do 40K videos, 40K? 40K, God, that'd be like 4,023 by the time that comes out. But yeah, 4K, could you imagine the quality on that though, 40K? But yeah, to be able to do 4K, I have to pay for that. So... Let me know if you guys think it's worth it. I think it's already technically 4K now. I mean, look. Look at the quality on that. Look. Look at it. Where's the remote? Where's the remote? Here it is. Beep, 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 beep. Whoa. Press it on using this for a call. I swore in the first two seconds of the video. It was amazing. That's a new feat for me. Okay. Hit and miss. I see where Bell gets it from, Neil. Yeah, a mother. No doubt a lot of you are thinking the same thing. That is Rosie. That Bell is under there. I might just watch my own vlog. Literally, the weather yesterday, what the fun was going on there? I'm getting better at that. I am getting better at that. Just watching that vlog back, realising that my phone, nearly at the end of it, was about to die. So, excuse the mess. 
But let's get that wire out if I can. There you go. I'll unravel itself eventually. And where's that other wire? I had another wire here. Oh, bloody hell. Hang on. Yes, I'm going to clean my nails in a second, but I can only find one C type cable at the second. So, oh, wait. Bugger. What happened to that? I think I was showing the car door. Uh, I want to use that, but I think it's naff anyway. Um, oh, well, one of you is going to have to charge up at a time then. No, my luck. It's hiding around here. And yes, I kind of threw the plug on the floor because one, I don't intend to use it because I've got a free pin plug. But, easier. Yes, I'm not lazy. Deal with it. I was gonna use the free USB port, so you can see that one on the right. I was gonna use it, and I was gonna put it there, but I don't fancy being seat belted in by the wire. Right. Nail clippers next, that was under there. Ollie! Oh, there he is. All right, mate, I just wonder where you went. That's all. You're doing your yoga pose, are you, mate? Them videos I take of Ollie doing that, I sent straight to Georgia, my sister, because my sister's dog, technically. And I go, oop, another yoga pose. I don't hate me, I seem to have lost my nail clippers. This is going to be fun. I might find another pair of riding around here somewhere. Hopefully. They were still in my pocket. And the reason why I use my nail clippers is because of this bit. Click, you can, you can, you can, you can, you can, speaking Klingon. You can clean your nails with them. If that makes sense. This phone, for 10 seconds I went out there, I spoke to a guy called Michael from 21. Michael, thank you for telling me what you told me. I won't say because it's something to do with mum. But in the two seconds I was out there, well, I say two seconds, it was more like two minutes, my phone dropped from 85 to nearly 75. That's the heat, I reckon. 25th of August, can you hurry up, please? I might use some of that to get a new phone, a new iPhone, like an old iPhone, but with better battery, you know what I mean? Someone's tired. Mind you though, so is he. Come on, you. Yeah, you getting sidetracked. Who else am I talking to? She acts like I'm talking to someone else as well. Come here, madam. Bell, bell. Quick. She knows. She's remembered where the rabbits are. But yeah, I thought I'd just take Belle for a quick wee walk before her mum got home. And her nan. My mum, technically her nan, I suppose. Because her mum, if you count my mum as Rosie's owner, then technically her nan, really. Which makes nan her great nan, if that makes sense. Belle, Belle. Here, Nan, I know you watch some of these vlogs. How does it feel to be a great-grandparent, finally? <laughs> and, Nan, if you are watching this, your great-grandchild's having the best of time round the fair. <laughs> now, where are you going? Nutty dog. She's nuts. Again, the few man. Shane, Shane Bell don't appreciate the view. She just wants to go, go, go. She's probably looking for rabbits, actually. But they're all gone, Bell. I think Jack Russell's like you, I scared them off. Boo! <laughs> Nutty animal. She's nuts. Come on, you, Bell. This way. Crazy girl. Sometimes I have to cut across the grass a little bit because it's a 10 foot lead. So to stop her going past the trees, like the hotel I've asked us to, I have to cut across the grass so she don't 
get into the hotel ground. I don't know what their problem is though, because we obeyed by that footpath rules, we have to go past the trees anyway, so I don't know what the hell's going on there, but the hotel knows who they are. I know there's a few staff that watch my channel. See if you can talk to management about that, could you? I won't say the name of the hotel because I don't want them to get a bad rep. This is from what I've been told last year. I walked the dog around there. Not my dog, someone else's. I was looking after him. And I got told off for going past the trees. So it was by another staff member. I don't think it was the manager. But yeah, I'm just saying. She loves it. She loves it. She's got me back round here. I say back round here. So we went round the Great Haley. It was just up the road. But yeah. But we've got to go in now. It's like 30 degrees, mate. No wonder why I'm losing weight. Wow. You are making me go for proper long walks, you are. And I don't say that with hate. I say it with love. She's sniffing for something. Hang on. Whatever it was, she's forgotten about it. I think we're going to cut through the hedge line to get to the uh, woods. Hoping that takes you down there. So, the, the same woods I unlocked the gate for for the car park. But, um, yeah, it's more in the shade. She needs to get in the shade now. Look at that tongue. You're tired, aren't you? Look at that tongue. Yeah, she's had it. Right, we're going to cut through the edge line. This might be one of them things that's easier said than done find out in a second. Bobo, you should know where we're going by now, love. Lovely. I've just been stung by something. Are you pulling the leaf through, mate? Here we go. Might just cool off around here for a minute. Bell, come here. Of course, you can only go under, so now I've got to pull the leaf through. Bell. I know you want a longer walk, but I'd hate to burst your bubble, but home's that way. I've been out long enough. Bell. There you go, she's caught on. You can have a bit, of, you can have the lead, the whole lead, up until that house there, Bell. Yeah, she's quite clever. She does know. She will stop, eventually. She'll go past it and then come back to me. She'll be like, oh, you meant that house. Can you say which one? She knows where we are. This is going to be a random vlog. I don't know what to call half these vlogs anymore. I'm just making up titles on the go. I need a vlog name generator thing. He's on an ultra long lead. It's really two leads just stuck together. Ollie! Ollie, I went the wrong way, mate. Oh, you guys caught on quick. But yeah, he's using all of it. About nearly 20 foot. I think he needs about 30 foot. Ollie. Yeah, realistic. Don't know what the heck happened there. But realistically, I think he needs about 30 foot, maybe around here. It takes him a long time to actually sniff anything, if that makes sense. And if anyone's wondering why I acted that way to Ollie then, he was about to pee down a rabbit hole. I'll try to stop him from doing that. I mean, the poor rabbits. I mean, how would you feel if you walked out of your house to smell piss on your front door? You know what I mean? That's how the rabbits feel. If that makes sense. Wake up and like, ah, oh, lovely smell of piss. If you know what I mean. What are you doing, weirdo? Ollie, what are you doing? Oddball. What on God's green earth was all that blood and noise? Oi, you. No, she I heard you good. telling off your mother. She was a very good girl. Mm. She's a rosy weirdo. Oh, you know, I'm not, debate, I'm not debating that. 
just a bit weird sometimes. Bit like you. Quick visit, Bell. Yes, I'm wearing those shorts still with it. Thirsty? Muffer. Honestly, though, I say stuff like that to her, and I, I don't know where I'd be without her, though. I'd be bored out of my mind. That's where I'd be. Back again. Yes, I'm sorting that out. And with the power of editing. <laughs> Actually, I kind of need them. Love her. She's found her old teething toy. Mum, I've got to get your reaction to this. She's found her old teething toy. But she's bringing it out as well, I'll just show you. Bell Bell. Come on, come show Nanny. Where's Rose? Where's Rosie? Have you seen Rosie, Dad? Where's that dog gone? Oh well. She'll show up sooner or later. Rose, bud. Where's your mother, Bell Bell? Holy hell, this is the darkest room in the house. Until you do that. Come in here. Where's that naughty rosebud? Just came in here. That dog is like a lightning bolt. Rose. Your mother. Other than the chicken meatballs, this is her favourite treat. Can't remember what they're called. I think they're chicken meatball dumbbell things. I don't know. But you know them when you see them in the shop, though. Chew eaten. And she'll probably fall asleep now. Love her. Oh, going for dinner. You can stay here if you want. I don't mind. Do it. Ooh, that's nice, Dad. You want the light off? Uh, where do I put that bloody glass? Yeah. We don't have to clean this one. You put one thing down in here and good fucking luck finding it. And just like that, I'm tired. Bell's tired. And we go to bed. See you guys in tomorrow's vlog. Yes, I missed. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Forgot to say.